Good morning or good evening, depending on where you are in the world. Um, my name is Bobby Houston, and alongside my beautiful husband, Brian, we get to um, pastor what is Hillsong Church, not only in Australia, but around the world. And you know, um, right now, it is my great honor to bring what is the verse of the day for you version. And um, the beautiful verse that I've been um, entrusted with is 1 Thessalonians 5, verses 15 to 18. And it says, verse 16, let your joy be a continual feast. Verse 17, make your life a prayer. Verse 18, and in the midst of everything, be always giving thanks, for this is God's perfect plan for you in Christ Jesus. I personally love this. It's from the Passion Translation, which is a fairly recent new um, offering that has been brought to the table. But I personally love this. I love the idea that um, joy is a continual feast. You know, I love the idea that we have been invited um, to a heavenly feast in Christ. And you know, joy isn't inherent on circumstance. Actually, joy is a well within. The Bible teaches it is a well within that can be drawn upon. And I want to encourage you in whatever season that you're facing, whatever challenges you might be having or circumstance, there is a well of salvation. If Christ is within you, there is a well of salvation within you. And joy is that deep well that can be drawn upon regardless of circumstance. I love that it says, make your life a prayer. You know what? You're never going to come second by living in a stance or an attitude um, with your heart leaning towards heaven. God's heart is always towards us. Draw near to him and he will draw near to us. And then it says, in the midst of everything, be always giving thanks. You know, as a new Christian, I was taught from the very outset I got saved in the early 1970s as a 15-year-old girl. I'm now 63 years of age. And you know, I was always taught, you know, approach the Lord, approach life with a spirit of gratitude and with thanks. For it says, for this is God's perfect plan for you in Christ Jesus. This is a magnificent passage of scripture. And I really pray that the word of God is resonating strong and, um, and beautifully in your life. Thank you for listening. And I hope they have a great day in Jesus name. Amen.